in the name of Father, Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today's very special topic is Islamic Allah is like Satan. Islamic Allah is like a Satan. Why do I say that way? That Islamic Allah is like a Satan. Islamic Allah cannot be like a Satan if he is the Holy One. That is the condition. If he is the true God of the universe, then he cannot be like a Satan. If he speaks truth all the time, then he cannot be like a Satan. And uh, if he is sinless, he cannot be like a Satan. But if the qualities go against that, then he will definitely be like a Satan. I will not give uh, those many references that some people have given. But I will give the very, very solid references from Quran and Hadith, which will prove today that Islamic lies like a Satan. It's not a joke. It's very serious issue and serious thing. Islamic Allah is like a Satan. How and why? First of all, the Holy Bible which is prior to Islam, before Islam, not after Islam, and it's uh, fourth book the book of John chapter 8 and verse 44 it speaks about the Satan ye are of your father the devil and the lust of your father ye will do he was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth because there is no truth in him when he speaketh a lie, he speaketh on his own, for he is a liar and the father of it. That is from the Holy Bible. Now, I told you that I will give a very solid reference. And that solid reference from Quran is coming now. The first reference he gave from the Holy Bible, John chapter 8 verse 44, and now it's coming from the Quran. So what is that? It says, the noble Quran is in, in my hand. Surah 26 and verse 221 and 222, very, very solid ones. Shall I inform you, O people, upon whom the devils descend? That is the very relevant verse. They descend on every lying, sinful person. In bracket it says, one who tells lies. Now, Based on these two verses, if we prove that Islamic Allah is a holy one, then in the past, present, future, in the time zone and in the eternity, if he is, though he is not there, 
if he speaks truth all the time past present future in the time zone and in the eternity then he is the real holy god of the universe but if we prove that he also tells lies use or uses lies in his talk then nobody can stop from this fact that islamic allah is a liar and satan has a quality of lying satan has a quality to be, quality to be a liar so satan and allah can be one allah is equal to satan and allah is like a satan is that clear how can we prove that now that comes another question if we open hadith bukhari volume 6 hadith number 4714 it says when the quran was preached the jinns and evil spirits they accepted islam volume 6 of bukhari hadith number 4714 that is one verse then hadith bukhari volume 4 hadith number 2801 it proves that allah of islam or islamic allah is the allah of the kaaba where there were 360 idols it means he is not a allah of the whole universe it's a allah of kaaba the specific area very tiny area in the whole world bigger argument is this at the biggest that allah is a liar and if he is a liar he is like a satan and because satan lies which we give we give you the references we don't give you big list of, of references from here and there no the biggest proof that that allah is a liar is about Isa in Quran biggest lies of Allah if he is the holy one if if he gave the revelation to Muhammad if because he spoke many lies about Jesus Christ in Quran who is called Isa there changed his na- name from from G- Jesus Christ to Isa his birth place is under the palm tree totally wrong wrong information in Quran Allah s- speaks against the sonship of jesus christ that he is a son of god that is the biggest lie of allah and allah and satan if allah lies like satan then they are equal to each other allah speaks against the crucifixion of jesus christ the resurrection of jesus christ the as- the ascension of jesus christ the way it is mentioned in the holy bible allah speaks against the uh, trinity that is all lies because that is against the holy bible and these are the 
biggest lies in the whole universe. And if Allah is a liar and Satan is a liar, then where is the difference? They both are at the same place, at the same spot, same attitude, same qualities. Allah has the same qualities like Satan. I have given you very solid reference. Another reference is coming from the book of Tab Tabri, Hadith Tabri. It's uh, volume 6, page 141. The, na the narration is like this, the essence of the narration that Satan used to appear on Muhammad like an old man and used to speak good about Muhammad. Means no Gabriel, no angel. So that means the angel which is mentioned in the Quran or in Islam is actually a Satan. Because Tab Tabri in his hadith he clarified it very clearly that Satan used to appear on Muhammad like an old man. So who is the sender of that Satan? Satan? Who is the, who, who, who is the, who, who is the other power who used to send Satan to, to Muhammad? Any other liar? Who is that other liar? That Allah, Islamic Allah, who spoke against Jesus Christ in the Quran. So two liars are side by side doing the same things, speaking lies about Jesus Christ. And in the whole universe, Jesus Christ is the main character because he's God, main character. Is holy God, sinless, holy. And if Allah speaks against Jesus Christ, Satan speaks against Jesus Christ, so Allah and Satan are the same. But Allah is like a Satan and Satan is like Allah. Both are liars. No distinction. One should be very careful when somebody misleads you. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ, to the real master, the real owner of, of the whole, whole universe, and repent, and He is there to forgive you. Hope you understand the message of today. God bless you.